this is ideal conditions for a trial. Usually I pick this zone because you're pretty protected in here, so we get pretty good reciprocal runs to get an average speed, just so you can offset any current. At the same time, we're gonna get speeds, fuel burn, percent engine load, and a check of where our interceptor trim is. We don't want to over trim too much because like if you're coming back in an inlet, you kind of want to have right, a, a little, little bit of a favoring to bow up attitude. Go. Let's do that one more time. Ready, set, go. It's pretty, it's pretty fun. <laughs> There's a lot of science behind the, the point at which that those pods come around and the boat's over center. So it's so comfortable when you're that was really that nice. turn. Yeah. So far so good, yeah, really yeah. good. Right in the middle of the kind of window of prediction here. Uh, hang on, 3, is everybody up here? This is what I was impressed with. For this much of a boat with those engines, like it doesn't, Dilly dally. Because I was concerned with N3 propellers. I thought, well, maybe it'll be a little slow to get up on plane and, and go on, but she's up there along pretty good. Hang on, Joe. <laughs> now, what we ought to do, Kevin, is also try from joystick driving yeah. to do that same feature because hard overturn with joystick driving, he's more aggressive. How do you like that step? I, love it. I could go for another. I think for somebody at Cormier's height, Crawford's height, that they probably don't yeah. need or want it because you put them too high. But not. Oh man, this feels good.